I want to demonstrate how to use the create arc polar endpoints command. The first thing I want to do is set my construction depth down here. So I'm going to right click in the Z field, tell it I'm going to set the construction depth to the coordinate of point. So I'm going to come out here and select the endpoint down here and set my construction depth. Next I'm going to look at the top view of my part. And I'm going to activate the command. So from the drop down menu I can choose create arc, arc polar endpoints. I am going to create a one inch radius arc, so I'll leave this here. The starting point for my first arc will be here. I'm going to start at zero degrees and I'm going to sweep through to 90 degrees. And I'll apply that. Now I want to create another arc polar sweeping through 90 degrees with a one inch radius, but starting at this endpoint. Remember, angles are measured counterclockwise from the horizontal axis, so my starting angle this time is 180. I want a clockwise arc, and my ending point is 270 degrees. I'll fit the screen. I'm happy with that. So I set the radius, start angle, end angle, and accept my selection. If we look at it isometrically, I've created these two arcs that I want to add to my geometry over here, rechain it, so that I'm sweeping into my cut with a clockwise arc. And the intention here is to form the chip to make a thick to thin chip. And I'll save my work.